uh, we present our paper titled uh, Effect of Choice of Probability Distribution, uh, Randomness and Search Method for Alignment Model in Sequence to Sequence Text Space Sense using uh, Hard Alignment. The presenter is uh, Yusuke Asuda. Uh, in this paper, we investigate effect of, effect of uh, various uh, alignment prediction methods for hard alignment based TTS called SSNT TTS. We first introduce SSNT TTS, then we describe conditions investigated for alignment prediction method. Uh, next, we show our experiment and its results. Finally, we conclude our findings. First, we will introduce SSNT TTS. Sequence to sequence TTS is a TTS method that directly predicts ac acoustic feature from text. Unlike pipeline TTS method that consists of multiple me models, the sequence to sequence method is a single model that can implicitly run alignment between input text and output acoustic feature. One of the most popular TTS methods in sequence to sequence framework is Tactron. Tactron consists of encoder and decoder. The encoder encodes linguist feature into linguist representation. The decoder decodes acoustic features from the linguist representation in autologous way. Alignment between input linguist features and output acoustic feature is estimated by soft attention mechanism. Soft attention does not model alignment explicitly. It models alignment as uh, expectation of linguist features. As well as tactron, SSNT TTS consists of uh, encoder and decoder, autoregressive decoder. Uh, however, it explicitly defines alignment with hard attention instead of soft attention. SSNT TTS derives the probability of output given input by marginalizing joint probability of alignment and output given input with respect to alignment. Here, alignment is a latent variable. The joint probability is factorized into alignment probability and output probability. The most prominent difference between Tactron and SSNT TTS is alignment. We present the difference schematically. Tactron's alignment is an uh, expectation of ling linguistic inputs. On the other hand, alignment of SSNT TTS is hard, uh, which means a uh, single uh, linguist input. So it consists all pos it considers all possible alignments uh, during the marginalization process. Uh, but why does SSNT TTS adapt uh, hard alignment instead of soft attention? Uh, it is because uh, soft attention has a big issue, uh, that is fatal alignment errors. For TTS task, alignment between source and target must be monotonic. However, because of uh, undesirable flexibility of soft attention, soft attention sometimes gives uh, obvious alignment errors, like these pictures. Because of the monotonic nature of speech, SSNT TTS de designs its alignment structure to be monotonic. We introduce a binary alignment transition variable to guarantee monotonic alignment. The alignment transition variable has two values, emit and shift. Emit means alignment keeps its current input position. Shift means alignment proceeds to the next input position. Uh, for more, more detail, please refer to the papers below. Uh, during training, uh, SSNT TTS considers all possible alignments to compute the marginal probability. The focus of this paper is inference. How can we find the most optimal alignment during inference? Uh, we investigate three aspects, randomness, search methods, and probability distributions. 
The first aspect is randomness. Randomness may be effective for alignment prediction because of the uh, non-deterministic nature of speech. First, we describe a relationship between greedy decode and sampling from Bernoulli distribution. Uh, to do so, we implement the uh, sampling from Bernoulli distribution with a uh, Gamber-Max trick. According to Gamber-Max trick, sampling from Bernoulli distribution can be implemented by adding uh, Gamber noises to the two rosets, followed by argmax operator. Uh, this is equivalent to adding logistic noise to one of the two logits and applying argmax operator. Uh, therefore, the difference between greedy decode and sampling from Bernoulli distribution is the presence of logistic noise. We will investigate the effect of the logistic, logistic noise uh, in our experiment. The second aspect is search method, because SSNTTTS uses autoregressive decoding. Alignment probability depends on the previous prediction. Because of the autoregressive decoding, we want an uh, advanced search method to consider uh, many possibilities of alignment along of out outputs. Greedy search is a basic search method. It simply takes a path with the highest probability at each time step. Alternatively, uh, we can use a beam search, another com common but uh, advanced search method. Beam search keeps top k alignment, uh, alignment candidates at each time step. Because of this, uh, we can consider multiple alignments and outputs. Uh, predicted by autoregressive decoding. For example, in the case K3, uh, there are three alignment paths and six next pathways at each time step. Beam search takes uh, top three next pathways at each time step. At the last step, uh, beam search selects a path with the highest probability as a final alignment. We can see greedy search is a special case of beam search where k is 1. We can combine the randomness and search method. We can add a logistic noise during search. If we add logistic noise during greedy search, it is equivalent to sampling from Bernoulli distribution, as we already saw. In the same way, we can derive stochastic beam search by adding logistic noise during beam search. The third aspect is probability distribution. Because we want to sample alignment randomly, we need proper underlying uh, distribution function. The first distribution is logistic distribution. As we saw, in gamber max trick, sample from, from Bernoulli distribution can be drawn with from a logistic distribution followed by argmax operator. We will refer to this as a logistic condition. Alternative probability distribution is concrete distribution. Concrete distribution is continuous distribution uh, but it has relaxed ho form of uh, discrete distribution like uh, Bernoulli distribution. Therefore, it is stable to argmax operator. Uh, it is parameterized with alpha and lambda. The lambda parameter is called uh, temperature parameter, and it controls degree of discretization. Lower temperature encourages more discretization. Sample from binary concrete distribution can be drawn with a uh, sigma function plus uh, logistic noise. Uh, combining the randomness, search, and probability distribution all together, uh, we can implement all combination of alignment pre prediction methods. The two probability distribution can be implemented by uh, 
changing the location of, of adding logistic noise. Uh, for logistic condition, uh, logistic noise is added after sigmoid function. For binary concrete condition, uh, logistic noise is added before sigmoid function. If logistic noise is omitted, uh, alignment variation is deterministic. For such method, uh, greedy or beam search can be used. Uh, this is our experiment for the alignment sampling method. Uh, to investigate which combination of alignment prediction methods is better than others, uh, we conducted a listening test about naturalness. Uh, we used a Japanese speech corpus to build an uh, SSNT TTS model. For waveform generation, we used a uh, WaveNet. For alignment prediction co conditions, we included 18 combinations, uh, including three temperature parameter values. Uh, this is the result of the listening test. Uh, about randomness, a deterministic condition always outperformed uh, stochastic conditions. Uh, about such methods, uh, beam search performed better than greedy search under deterministic conditions. Uh, on the contrary, beam search performed uh, worse than greedy search under stochastic and logistic conditions. About priority distributions, the performance of a logistic condition is same as binary concrete conditions under deterministic conditions. However, the performance of logistic condition is much worse than binary concrete conditions under stochastic condition. The pure performance of logistic condition is mitigated by lowering, lowering temperature parameter. We infer the logistic and binary con concrete conditions can estimate the alignment transition boundaries properly because both conditions had uh, similar scores under deterministic search. However, we think the logistic condition does not parameterize proper alignment transition distribution because the logistic condition performed very badly under stochastic, stochastic search. On the contrary, we pr presume the binary concrete condition can fill the gap between continuous and discrete, con discrete distributions because the binary concrete conditions were relatively robust to stochastic search condition. In conclusion, uh, we investigated alignment prediction methods for SS and TTTS. The conditions for alignment prediction included uh, randomness, such method, and probability distributions. Our experiment shows that uh, deterministic condition was favorable than stochastic condition. Beam search was helpful to improve naturalness, and the binary concrete distribution was uh, relatively robust and a classic such. Uh, thank you for listening.